there's, there's a minority uh, among, I wouldn't call them critics of Israel, but there's a, there are anti-Semites out there who happen to be neo-fascists and racists who are building connections with a larger movement of Islamophobes um, and who are sort of preternaturally or viscerally Islamophobic. They're just and, and, and racist and afraid of the other. And Jews, of course, have been otherized. Uh, European Jews have been otherized for centuries. So they're, they're you know, and, and, and you know, I, I, I've, I've covered white supremacist, white nationalism, neo-Nazis. I've interviewed, um, you know, leaders and rank and file. And uh, I, I remember I interviewed, I forget his name now, but I, I, I spoke to the um, publisher of the in, uh, Institute for Historical Review, which is the leading publisher of historical revisionism or Holocaust denial. And I said, why do you, what do you have against the Jews? He said, you know, essentially, in a nutshell, what he told me is that they're responsible for liberalism. Um, so this kind of anti-Semitism flows from illiberalism or anti-liberalism. And a lot of the Jews who are attracted to Palestine solidarity um, come from liberal backgrounds um, and are very you know, tolerant. Many of them are queers. Uh, many of them are you know, anarchists. Many are standard liberals or leftists. But they're all people who would actually be hated by these kind of figures, these anti-Semites. And so what we've been witnessing in the Palestine solidarity movement um, and I've been an active part of this, um, from Palestinians and from uh, you know, Jewish supporters of Palestine Solidarity, is an effort to completely clean the movement out of these kind of people. And one person, um, I think the, one of the leading anti-Semitic um, critics of Israel, you couldn't even call him a critic of Israel, he's an ex-Israeli who um, pretends to be an anti-Zionist but is actually just a pure anti-Semite and who believes that all of the, the, the problems of Israel st uh, flow not from colonialism, but from Judaism, is Gilad Atzmon. And I signed a Jewish letter uh, denouncing him and basically telling him to get lost. There's been a Palestinian letter organized by Ali Abu Nema and um, you know, a, a who's who of Palestine solidarity activists who say, anti-Semitic freaks, get the hell away from us. We don't want any part of you. Um, and there have been other efforts um, to castigate people who have advanced um, anti-Semitic critiques of Israel and of Jews in general. So, I mean, that's how I would respond, is just judge the Palestine Solidarity Movement, which is an organized movement um, advancing, I think, a principled form of anti-Zionism. Judge them by what they're doing. And they don't need pressure from pro-Israel groups. They don't need to be shamed to do this. This is how they feel. This is how I feel. It's just we're genuinely disgusted by any form of racism. It's why we're disgusted by the Israeli government and by the, the, the structure of Israeli apartheid. Okay, let's jump to what's...